He is one of the biggest pop sensations, makes millions of fans swoon, and has always been surrounded by mystery when it comes to his sexuality and dating life. She is an established actress, has been married and in several long-term relationships, and has directed him in a movie. Harry Styles and Olivia Wilde's relationship has sure given fans a lot to talk about. The couple met when Harry starred as one of the main characters in Olivia's film Don't Worry Darling. However, the actor and singer wasn't always the first choice for the role. In fact, Shia LaBeouf had already been hired to play Harry's character but left the project in August 2020. However, even if Olivia was disappointed after Shia left, she quickly became happy again when she learned that Harry Styles would join the cast. In an interview with Vogue, the actress explained that she and the costume designer did a little victory dance when they found out. She also praised Harry's confidence, saying it was completely devoid of any traces of toxic masculinity. It's pretty powerful and kind of extraordinary to see someone in his position redefining what it can mean to be a man with confidence, she said. Remember that everything that people say about you isn't true. Whether they say that you are horrific, it's not true. And if they tell you that you're the best thing ever, it's not true. In November 2021, Olivia officially split from her fiance, Jason Sudeikis. The former couple had been together for nine years and had two children. Initially, it seemed like the breakup was amicable. A source told People Magazine, they've transitioned into a great co-parenting routine. The children are the priority and the heart of the family's relationship. Another source told Entertainment Tonight that the split was a decision they made together. There was absolutely no drama or scandal. They just didn't work as a couple anymore, they said. Actually don't think that is as much about me as it maybe seems. Things did turn sour later, but before we get into this, let's dive into Harry and Olivia's relationship. In early 2021, some pictures of the actors holding hands surfaced online. Soon after, Harry and Olivia were spotted attending his agent's wedding at a ranch in California. According to Us Weekly, a source even said that the singer had referred to Olivia as his girlfriend during his wedding speech. An insider revealed to People magazine that the couple had been dating for some time. They have dated for a few weeks, the source clarified. Another source told Entertainment Tonight that the lovebirds got to know each other while filming Don't Worry Darling. What I like about acting is I feel like I have no idea what I'm doing and it's quite fun. Olivia and Harry are together for long days on set and have gotten to know each other really well, so it's all very organic, they stated. Olivia wouldn't let a romantic relationship get in the way of a professional one, so anything they're doing is being done thoughtfully. Well, we are happy they were able to make it work. But how did they manage to keep it professional while they were dating? Apparently, they worked hard to keep it a secret during filming. They were very careful about it and even sleuthy at times, although the small group of people who were on set with them every day eventually figured it out, a source told Us Weekly. My most important advice for being a badass woman in Hollywood or anywhere else, trust your gut, trust your instincts, know who you are, know your why, and don't let anybody get in your way. The couple continued hitting it off in the following months. So much that Olivia decided to publicly support her boo after he won his first Grammy in March 2021. She uploaded some pictures to Instagram stories where the singer was featured, among some other iconic musicians. One month later, the lovebirds traveled to the United Kingdom together. This trip was apparently amazing for them, since it allowed the couple to have a lot of one-on-one -on -one time. A source talked to Entertainment Tonight about the pair's holiday, saying, Their idea of a good time is going for a long walk and ducking into a neighborhood pub. It sure sounds like a fun time. Both actors seem to like the UK a lot. In fact, in June 2021, they were seen in London again. This time around, they decided not to hide their relationship. A source told ET Online that the two were having an awesome time and had grown ever closer as a couple. Olivia and Harry were not shy when it came to PDA and even left a restaurant holding hands. Finally, their love was out in the open and they enjoyed traveling together so much that only a month later, they were seen making out in a boat in Italy. Ah, summer of love. In September 2021, Harry began his incredibly successful stadium tour. Of course, his girlfriend was there to support him on the opening night in Las Vegas. An eyewitness even told E! News that Wilde was very happy and danced all night. She was singing along to almost every song and having a good time with the people she was with, they explained. The couple continued showing their happiness to the world in the following months. 
Wilde was spotted wearing Styles' gold cross necklace while attending a fashion show in November. A few weeks later, the director was interviewed by Vogue, where she subtly talked about their relationship and the public scrutiny it involved. What you realize is that when you're really happy, it doesn't matter what strangers think about you, she said. All that matters to you is what's real and what you love and who you love. The actress added that she's happier and healthier than she's ever been, and we sure are happy for her. During this time, Wilde even introduced the singer to her kids. A source told people that Harry was also spending time with Olivia's mom, so the relationship seemed to be getting serious. They made an effort to see each other, even when Styles was busy touring and Wilde was filming her next project. They try to see each other as much as possible, the source continued. Olivia has been flying non-stop between LA, where her kids live, to join Harry on tour. Harry has also opened up about Olivia, although he was more subtle and focused on the professional aspect of their relationship. In May 2022, he was interviewed on Howard Stern's Sirius XM show, where Stern asked him if he fell in love on a movie set. The singer and actor replied, I had a wonderful experience being directed by Olivia. I think there is something that obviously, acting is very uncomfortable at times. I think you have to trust a lot. We needed whoever was going to play Jack to be instantly lovable and someone who was deeply charming and empathetic. And I knew that Harry and Flo would be beautiful together and that they would work really well together. The actor is known for being very private about his relationships. In an interview with Rolling Stone, Harry explained this by saying, I've never talked about my life away from work publicly and found that it's benefited me positively. When talking about his upcoming film, My Policeman, he added, I think everyone, including myself, has your own journey with figuring out sexuality and getting more comfortable with it. Okay, so we know just how happy this pair is, but what about Olivia's ex? How did Jason Sudeikis take the fact that Wilde was moving on? Well, when the couple started dating, there were conflicting reports about Jason, with some saying he was doing okay and others claiming that he was heartbroken. What we do know is what happened during the bizarre incident in April 2022, where the ex's story famously turned sour. This is for me, right now? <laughs> this is very mysterious. Wilde was promoting Don't Worry Darling at CinemaCon when somebody in the first row handed her an envelope, which turned out to be custody papers from Sudeikis. A representative of the actor told Deadline that he had no idea the papers would be served that way, and that it was a choice made by the process service company, not him. The director did not believe this. In a court motion obtained by the Daily Mail, she wrote, Jason's actions were clearly intended to threaten me and catch me off guard. She also believed that the actor's gesture had gone against their children's interests. However, Jason insisted that he had nothing to do with it. I deeply regret what happened. Olivia's talk was an important event for Olivia, both professionally and personally, and I am very, very sorry that the incident marred her special moment, he said in a court filing. As for all the endless tabloid gossip and all the noise out there, I mean, the internet feeds itself. I don't feel the need to contribute. I think it's sufficiently well-nourished. It seems like Olivia and her ex are not in the best place right now. Hopefully, Harry has been a support for her during what must have been a difficult time. After all, the singer also knows a thing or two about having famous exes. He had a few dates with pop superstar Taylor Swift when they were younger, and she famously dedicated a few songs to him, including Style. Which songs on your last album were about me? <laughs> Styles has also dated model Kendall Jenner, a member of the Kardashian family who he is still great friends with. So what is going on with Harry and Olivia now? Certain rumors say the lovebirds are engaged, although they haven't confirmed anything themselves. It was Instagram account Dumois, which has over a million followers that announced the news. Someone gave me information that leads me to believe this is true, the account owner claimed. Whoever this owner is, they have been right about other celebrities on several occasions. Only time will tell if they are this time, though. What do you guys think the truth is? Leave your opinion in the comments. Here at Rumor Juice, we hope the pair can continue living their happy life and, occasionally, share a few glimpses with us. Be well and be kind.